What's up guys? My name is Andrew Miley with AMM Sounds Recording bringing you another awesome video today. I'll make it short and sweet and right to the point. Um, today I'm going to show you guys how to make a template in Studio One Pro. Now this should go the same as far as any other studio version, Studio One version, so um, yeah. So anyway, to make a template here, you're just going to want to come over and hit create new song. Okay. <coughs> now I just made a video. Well, at least I just attempted to make a video for you guys. And I made this template, but the video didn't come out for some reason. So I'm just going to make another one. Um, you're going to see some tabs here. Boom, 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 boom. Styles, interfaces, and user. Let's focus right here on user and make sure we have this empty song selected in case there's any other templates in there that maybe somehow got in there but for the most part you're probably going to have empty song okay so you're going to have empty song selected you're going to come over here and punch in the title of your template and I am just going to do tutorial temp all uppercase okay and then right below that, you're going to want to select where you want to save this. Um, usually, you should probably just keep it with where all your songs are saved. You know, me, I have it on a little external hard drive, um, and that's where it's staying. But you can pick whatever you want. After that, leave all this stuff alone. You, you probably don't need to change any of that. I'll get into that um, in a different video anyway. After you t type in your song title, in this case your uh, template title click OK and it should bring up an empty screen like this well yours will probably look something like this okay now right away I just like to save this as a template just in case I get out of you know out of control and start building things and I forget that I was making a template or whatever I go to file and I do save as template and there is your title right there. You can even put a little description in. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. And if you have any channel or um, icon art, maybe you want to save us a particular photo of yourself, cheesing real big, or whatever it is you want, you can put it right there. Okay. Um, also, there's another option right here, which is replace existing, which I will show you in just a second. So after you punch in your description or whatever, and your art, hit OK. Now that just created a template for you. And it made a little folder inside of your where you save your songs and stuff like that. It's going to say presets. And it's going to be inside of there. So now when you have your, you have a blank canvas. Okay, so now you can start building stuff. And uh, adding tracks and however you want your template to be set up you know that's a matter of preference and whatever you're setting it up for so you go ahead and start adding tracks obviously you can hit T start adding tracks um, you know here's two tr audio tracks we'll make that mono um, ascending boom there's two tracks there let's make these stereo we'll make these bright yellow we'll do four of them boom that's that okay now say that's all you wanted for your template and you were ready to save it and get out of here so you don't need to waste any more time making a template and you can get down to the real business which is making music boom up here and just click on the same tab again which would be save as template after you sit, uh, click on save as template, just hit replace existing and find whatever one you want to save it over top of. Um, click open and click OK. And after you've done that, you are good to go. And that is how you make a template. Thanks and um, make sure you check out some of my other videos. All right, take it easy.